say, let it be known. I'm working hard when I ain't on the phone. This ain't a hunt, this ain't a foe. Grind never stopping, I'm keeping it cold. Unlocking the door with the What's up, y'all? It's Elena, and I'm going to be reacting to It's Always Sunny in Philadelphia, season four, episode 12. Last episode, we went back in time because apparently the gang were the reason why the Liberty Bell had cracked. Almost the entire episode had nothing to do with the Liberty Bell cracking. Mac had wooden teeth. We got Frank and Charlie. Apparently they were thieves <laughs> or traitors, you know, and they they bought a bunch of guns that couldn't shoot and they blamed it on Dee because everybody thought that she was a witch and at the end it turned out that she was a witch. And because the guns wasn't working, Frank was trying to like figure it out, like why it wouldn't shoot and then shoot Cricket's head off. It was a mess. That whole episode was a mess. I know that lady who was listening to that story was just old. I just know she felt like she made the biggest mistake letting these fools in her office tell her a story, a fake story. That ain't make no sense. But we're going to get into this episode, though. If you want to see my full reaction to this episode, check out my Patreon. The link is in the description below. Let's get into it. Yeah, dude, you totally cried. Yeah. I didn't cry, Charlie. I saw tears coming out of your eyes, Extreme man. home makeover will make the hardest man soft. Oh, I, <laughs> I used to love that show. Dennis, do you know that she is inheriting my house? Of course he knows it. He's the one who lost the house by letting you into it. And now since I'm his next of kin, the house belongs to me. What the hell's a vision board? Oh, it's the secret. Yeah, the secret is a self-help book that Dee read and explained to us. It's about how you can get whatever you want without having to work for yeah, it. Yeah, man, all you have to do is envision all the shit in the world that you want, cut pictures of it out, and paste it on a board. And then you get it. You get the stuff. Check it out. See how I got That's all not how that works, but okay. And I'm going to impregnate Danica Patrick while getting drunk in the Sahara Desert on a dune buggy. <laughs> First of all... You know, this if is Charlie's so house is a mess, it's all how is gonna make? <laughs> how are you gonna fix my else house? That's funny, cause that's how I got the house. I did some good deeds, and boom, I'm rich, mansion rich. Whoa, wait a second. What good deeds? You didn't say anything about doing good deeds. Is that a part of this? Oh yeah, yeah, that's part of it. You have to do that. You get back what you put in. Wait a second. Maybe helping other people is the best way to help ourselves. Right, right. So like, what um, is I don't the best like it. way? I don't like this. People, the best way in the world to help other people. What would Ty Pennington do? What would Ty Pennington do? <sighs> so we gonna tear up some houses today. Okay. I'm ready for it. <laughs> I'm ready. I ran the numbers and I'm going to need a buttload of money to pay the property taxes on my new mansion. My mansion. Jesus, Frank, really? Frank, Still? you well, lost you it. You don't Get over it. That's not the point, Dee. See, I'm operating at a much higher vibration, which I think is going to counteract his attempts at positive energy. I'll whoa, keep the house. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You think that so they were talking about vibrations and energy back then? <laughs> Let's find a family to unleash our extremeness all over. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A desperate family that's going to yield us the highest return. How about the Mexican family that moved in down the block? Right. What is their name? The Juarez family, I think. Oh, that's perfect. Okay, okay. And okay. I think I have the most extreme way to go about this. Oh okay, my gosh. Got the yeah. right? Well, do you guys think that the blindfolds are absolutely yes, necessary? This does necessary. not look good at all. The sense of surprise and excitement, creating an enjoyable experience. That little ass wrecking ball. Oh my gosh. I would feel like I woke up in hell. I, oh my gosh! That place is atrocious, I ain't gonna lie. But, um, this is too much. I just know they're terrified. <laughs> Let her go! Now you're going now we're just gonna suffocate him now. Ooh. Yep. Alright. Good job. Good job. Frank, Foreman, what's the plan? Welcome to Makeover Headquarters, Juarez family. This is gonna be your home for the next couple of days. Hey, in order to assimilate you with American culture, we've decided to surround you with all things American. <laughs> now who's ready for a makeover? <laughs> this one is. Tell them um, to relax, uh -huh. first off, because they look a little tense. Okay. And then uh, we're going to build them a new house uh -huh. and a new life, uh -huh. just like on Extreme Makeover on TV. Can they even speak <laughs> English? Juarez's, sea fácil. Su casa es no más. 
Su vida es no más. Oh, no. Somos extremos. Como la televisión. Sí. Sí. Uh, sí. Ah, sí, they get it. <laughs> I still got they it. Get it. Somos yeah. extremos. <laughs> yeah, America. Man, why, why did we come to this country? Look at charming place. I could have had sentimental value and you just destroyed their shit. Bro, they're Americans now. They're building an I can't build a whole house. You know what? Let's just smash the wall. Start with the wall. And then we'll This is ridiculous. And then we'll get our Lamborghinis or You're not getting a Lamborghini. Y'all ain't getting nothing. But a charge. Has anybody scored on their vision board yet? How on earth are we scoring from our vision board? Just start it. Yeah, we've been doing this for like 30 minutes. 30 minutes, man. I feel like I've been sleeping for a day. That broke bastard's bed is soft as shit. <laughs> you think they got any beer in the icebox? Yeah, well, I could drink a swimming pool. You know, Frank, you are a terrible oh. I watch Extreme Home Makeover. I know how it works. Charlie, what? That show is just a, a bunch of manipulation to get people to cry. Facts. And then they trick the viewers into buying shit. Buying shit? What, what are you talking they about? They did. Yes. That show is about how awesome Sears is. No, and how no. Sears products save people's lives. Oh, and it's about caring oh, and Sears. Oh, and oh, and oh, I'm not... Uh, Man, you don't see Ty Pennington losing his I heard a lot of people's yeah. lives right, well, like were destroyed after that show. No pienso que estas personas son la migra. Yo pienso que estamos secuestrados. You you have been been kidnapped, brother. Oh my gosh, Mac, why? Baseball. Huh? Please. This is not making it better. <laughs> Frank, what the hell are you doing here? Those dickwads threw me off my own work site. So how's the old vision board coming? You getting everything you want? Yeah. Here, why don't you be a lamb and pass out some materials? Go on. What? Be time. helpful. Do something positive with your life, you piece of shit. <laughs> magazines, magazines. Here, magazines. And cut them out with this. Frank, what are Frank, you looking at? Frank, she doesn't understand what you're saying. No, no, if you gotta say corta, that means cut. Corta, corta! <gasps> oh! oh! Y'all need to take Frank to the um hospital because she stabbed him right in the thigh. Um, no Jose K hombre lo lastima. See? That makes sense. Yeah. Frank then shot like four people <laughs> in these four seasons, I believe. <laughs> He's not playing. Well, what does a little Mexican girl love more than anything else in the world? Tacos. Tacos, buddy. So why not make for her a taco? She's <laughs> like, what the fuck am I listening to? What is this um blowtorch for, man? Well, that, that's a propane torch. That thing's badass, yeah. man. It's like a flamethrower. Okay, but what what function is it gonna serve? It's for the home? renovation, man. It's for the control. You about to burn that damn house to the ground? Burns, man. Are you kidding me, bro? bro? They definitely do control burns on the show. They, they do it off screen. Off screen. You know what I mean? Yeah. How do you think they tear down an entire wall so quickly? They burn I, well, it up. The community's got a lot to do with it, and then maybe it's for burning the extra. Yeah, it's for rubble. tearing stuff down. They, they take sure stuff outside. I'm and they, sure we, well, we, I'm buying it, so go okay. ahead and ring that. Why do they have these conversations in front of people? And okay. Like why? Put all this on the extreme home makeover account. Bring it up. I have no idea what you're talking about. Really? Uh, we're performing extreme home makeover. Oh. You know what? Um, if you just give us the stuff, we'll be on our yeah. way. Y'all could be on y'all way I now. Don't just give stuff away. If y'all ain't got no I money. Mean, I don't know why you're breaking my balls here. Sears does this, okay? Sears gives people stuff. Sears doesn't get anything out of it. Sears doesn't come in and start... Look, we don't have any money, okay? What are we supposed to do here? I don't know what to tell you. If you don't have a bad credit history, you can open up a store credit card. Uh oh. Well, yeah. Credit card. Uh oh. All right, just go ahead and sign right there, and we're all set. Now this is smart. Yeah. The first step to becoming an American, get a credit card. Oh yeah, man. We need this guy to build up copious amounts of debt. That's yeah. the best way for him to build up his credit. We're doing him a favor. We're doing him a huge Kidding? favor. And do you realize how extreme this is to go oh, from no man. debt to good old-fashioned American debt? That's, That's the way it. to do it. Oh, uh, by the way, does anyone know why the hell Frank has been pointing a camera at us? I'll tell you why. Because I'm tired of this secret bullshit. <laughs> all it got me was a stab wound in the leg. So I'm gonna record everything you do. Why? Because I know you're gonna fail. Then I can watch it over and over again. Oh, that's ridiculous. That man ain't got no faith in them. Bro, I'm not sure I have the right look here. No, you do, man. You, you're just gonna start thinking of the tool belt as an extension of yourself. It, it needs to reflect you as an individual. Why Dennis got the thighs out? Do we need to see your thighs, Dennis? And you got Tim's on? 
That, sir, is because you purchased blue jean shorts, whereas I purchased blue jeans and cut them. Double. Take a wide stance. Take the widest stance that you possibly can. Let me okay, see that leg like. movement. This is, uh, as wide as you if can. I'm going wide and I'm being honest with you, mm -hmm. I'm maxing out about here. That's not bad. <laughs> this is ridiculous. But check this what out. What the hell is this? Go, go, go. <laughs> okay, Dennis. Any more? That's it, but that's pretty wide, right? That is good. You know, good, and right? you're not getting any high ride. I'm getting a high that's ride, a better... but the shorts aren't preventing me from doing what I need to do. And that's the shorts. <laughs> that's exactly right, man. And see, your shorts, they're holding you back, man. Well, that and your hips. But I got to tell you, the shorts aren't helping. Uh, this, this is really all good shit. This is like gold. <laughs> right. So what are you going to do next? You are catching all this, I right? got everything. Oh, this one, wait, can I see the stance one more time? Yeah. That, I can go lower. <laughs> I bet you can, little freak. So stupid. I think I know what we're not doing right here. What? We haven't brought the neighborhood in yet. Absolutely great idea. Bring the neighbors in. Yeah, bring the neighbors so I can call the cops on y'all dumb ass because this is too much. Y'all doing too much. Oh my gosh. Frank, you ready? I've never been ready for anything more in my entire life. Frank, are you up to something? You're a little bit too well, excited for me. Successfully pulled off one extreme makeover. Yeah, I love their eyes. Now, while we wait, I was thinking we expose them to some good old-fashioned American cinema, oh. Apocalypto. They can learn about how their ancestors used to be savages until Mel Gibson and the Catholics came in and saved everything. Apocalypto, huh? That's their history, huh? Frank. Hey, you're just in time. Why don't you point that video camera at the new and No, what? I'm not even gonna say this on camera. Whoa. I'm just leave it alone. They look freaky as shit. Bag them and bring them with us. Come on. Yes, let's go. In fact, bag yourselves too, because I want this to be a surprise. You know, okay. okay. Is he plotting on We're them? Right, like, Frank. keep walking straight. Oh, God damn I don't it. understand. Straight, 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 straight. Okay, hold it right here. All right now, excuse me. Move, Move that bus! And Frank just think this shit is a game. It's all it's all jokes, huh, Frank? Unbelievable. I cannot believe the judge made me give my mansion to the Juarez family. I can't believe their name isn't Juarez. Oh. Y'all lucky y'all not in prison. Yeah, well, you know, it's a, it's a broken system we got. Because if that was me. But at least we managed to avoid arson charges, right? <laughs> That's good. Best yeah. believe I'm pressing charges. Oh, I guess you're right. Secret's bullshit, huh? Yeah. You try to help people and you just wind up getting screwed. Y'all screwed them. So, another episode of the gang fucking people over. Um, but at least they got a mansion. So I guess it was worth it, kind of, you know. You know, even though they were kidnapped, locked up somewhere, had to make a vision board, had a gun pulled on them, had to wear contacts, a blonde wig, you know, opened up a credit line with Sears. Was it serious? No, it was it wasn't serious. It was um it was I don't know what store that was. I think it was all worth it, to be honest. Actually, no, I don't. I don't because they're not in prison. If they did that shit to me, well, she did stab Frank in the leg, so I guess it's kinda even. So I'm gonna let it slide. But like I said in the beginning though, why does Charlie feel like he can do this whole home makeover thing? And his apartment looks like crap. It looks like crap and it smells like crap. And then with Frank, I don't know why Frank is so upset. Because he's saying that's his house. You know, he don't want D to have the house. But at the same time, aren't you a millionaire? You can just buy another one. You can literally just get up and buy another one. But you don't want to do that. You just want to live with Charlie and sleep on his couch alongside with him in that crappy ass apartment i don't get that it must be like a pride or an ego thing like he probably feels like you know that's my house it should have been my house from the get-go but you know his ex-wife took it he probably just feels like you know that's his property and he wants no one to have it but one thing that i am confused on though what happened to bruce 
Like, did they ever tell us, like, how Bruce ended up giving the house away? I do remember him saying, I do remember the episode where he was giving away a lot of money to an organization or, like, a cause or something. But did he give away the house, too? Or did he give the house to D? I don't, I don't understand that. I know the actor is, like, in prison at this time, maybe. Or, like, he's going through some legal troubles at least that's what i heard yeah i had comments saying that he got into some trouble so i know he's not gonna be on the show no more but what happened at least you know i feel like this episode was a win-win for both sides they got to do their little extreme home makeover thing frank got his payback and the war has just got a mansion so it, everything's okay to me everything seems fine to me but um yeah yeah if y'all want to see my full reaction to this episode check out my patreon the link is in the description below Thank y'all for watching and I'll catch you on the next one. Bye. Hey, okay, let it be known. I'm working hard when I ain't on the phone. This ain't a hunt, this ain't a phone. Grind never stopping, I'm keeping it cold. Unlocking the door with the